My girlfriend has been trying to get me fired from all my jobs. I'm shaken. I'm M24, and I've been with my girlfriend, F29, let's call her Janice, for two and a half years. I had just finished my education when we started dating and have been doing various jobs, sometimes two at a time. I did this to expand my resume and gather job experience. I worked in cafes, bookstores, libraries, grocery stores, and as an English tutor. Most of these jobs lasted about three to five months. My shortest stay was two and a half weeks, and my longest was eight months. Since I didn't have a hard time applying for new positions, I tried to block it out, though it was eating me up inside. People called to complain about me, left bad reviews, used my employee Wi-Fi access to look up sketchy things under my name, former employees called to inform them about me, right name and all, and much more subtle stuff that I couldn't disprove. But I was too anxious to do anything about it. I just told my girlfriend, and she comforted and supported me every time my life got ruined by these people. But I kept going, though they kept finding me. Fast forward to this week. I currently hold a part-time position at a bakery, and I've been working there for two and a half months. It's going okay, but my manager approached me about something regarding our Google reviews. Someone was complaining about about an employee, and their description could only really fit me. It was on a day when we were pretty short-staffed, so for all I know, I could have been the only person in the store. Anyway, their review contained some pretty elaborate and nasty comments about me. This has happened in one or two of my previous jobs already. I told my manager that it was all pretty bogus and that someone had a vendetta against me, as it had happened before. She believed me and said she'd dismiss the comment. On my break, I checked out the review myself. Their username was kinda stupid, I'm not gonna type it out here since I still work there, but I'll call them Mick Myrtle as it sounded kinda fake but not really. Anyway, I came home but didn't tell Janice about it. She had heard it all before, so I didn't see the point in complaining about another time I almost lost my job. We chatted, and all was well, so she left the room. Her phone was on the table, and suddenly, she got a notification or an email from Google. I don't remember exactly what it said, but the pop-up read something like, Mick Myrtle, manager has responded to your review. My heart dropped. I've been trying to ignore it since, this was two days ago. It just fits with the bad reviews, phone complaints my workplaces have received about me in the past, and all the sketchy things I've been fired for. Why would she do that, though? I'm looking for an explanation. This literally can't be. She's the only thing keeping me sane. I don't know what to do. Update. Hello, people who are still invested. I'm sorry for not updating you earlier, a lot has happened. First of all, yes, we broke up. That's why I'll refer to her as my ex from now on. Let's start from the beginning. On Monday the following week, I couldn't take the uncertainty anymore. I told my ex I needed her booking account to book a train ticket to visit my dad for a few days. She complied, and when she was in the shower getting ready for work, I booked my ticket and started looking through her emails. After some digging, I found an email to herself which contained a spreadsheet file. I sent the file to myself, printed it out, and took a screenshot. Why? The spreadsheet contained every single piece of information about me. Numbers, emails, passwords, work times, colleagues, their numbers and social media, and some emails and passwords that she used for accounts to ruin my life with. Everything was on there, conveniently sorted for her to ruin my life as efficiently as possible. When she left for work, I decided it would be best to immediately pack my stuff. Nothing that mattered would be left behind. I felt like a wanted man. Like I was being hunted despite nothing being seemingly out of place. I called my boss, told her I would take some time off work, and headed to see my dad. Needless to say, he was the sanity I needed. I cried about everything I saw, I panicked for a whole two days straight about how my life was ruined, and I didn't know what to do. He had to sleep on the couch in the guest room because I was so scared of my ex coming in. He handled it like a champ. I love you, dad. He called the police, a lawyer, and most recently a therapist for me because I was in the most horrible state of my entire life. We're currently sorting out the legal stuff. I haven't talked to my ex except to let her know it was over and that she's a sick psychopath. My dad handled the rest. I changed all my passwords, and I'm now looking for a place to live. Sorry for the brief update, my mind is tangled up. Please ask questions if you want to know more. Edit, by the way, thank you to every single person who gave me advice, talked to me over DMs, or was generally concerned about me. I appreciate every single one of you.